Hi everyone, welcome back to Fast Cabling. Today in this video, we're diving into something crucial for small to medium sized businesses, data centers, and high tech labs, upgrading to a 10G network. But why 10G? Well, as businesses and organizations handle more data than ever before, having a 10G network eliminates bottleneck, boosts efficiency, and ensures smooth, lightning fast data transfer. Whether you're moving massive files, handling real time data processing, or running advanced applications, you need the right hardware to keep things flowing. And that's where this bad boy comes in. Now, this is our A port 10G SFP Plus Layer 3 Managed Switch. And let's take a closer look at what makes it so powerful for 10G networking. Now, check out the front panel. Now, right here, you've got a 1, 2.5, or 10G SFP Plus slot. Now, these aren't just for fiber, they can also support both fiber and copper SFP Plus module, making it incredibly versatile, depends on your setup needs. And whether you're connecting using high quality fiber optic cables or trusty CAT 6A or CAT 7 cable, this port have you covered. And here we've got the console port. Now this port gives you the direct management access for configuring the switch. And the back panel is simple but essential. We have the power input here and the grounding here. And no surprise, just what you need to keep things stable and secure. And let's talk performance. With a massive 160 gigabit per second switching capacity, this switch is a beast. It's designed to handle heavy traffic loads, making sure your network is fast and efficient, even under high demand. And with layer 3 management feature, it's not just fast, it's smart. You've got SNMP for network monitoring, QoS to prioritize data traffic, and LACP for link aggregation. And VLANs allows you to segment your network by department, application, or user group, giving you full control over how your network flow. And adding advanced security feature like port security, ACLs, and 802.1x authentication. So you're looking at a fully secure enterprise grade solution. And all this ensure your network runs securely and efficiently, even as it grows. Plus, it's IPv6 ready. This means you're all set for future proofing your network as we move into the next generation of internet addressing. And no need to worry about falling behind in the tech race. All right, so now we're in front of the demonstration board. Let's walk through setting this whole thing up. Here you can see a router providing internet. I'm going to use an ethernet cable to connect it to our A port managed switch. And first thing first, make sure you've got the right SFP plus module depending on your setup, whether you're using fiber or copper cable. And for this demo, we're using this SFP to RJ45 module and it is used to connect to our router and computer. So let's plug it into our SFP slot. Two of them. One for our router. The other one for our computer. And this is our SFP plus module. Now make sure you use BD SFP plus module because you can get more efficient fiber usage with a single string for transmitting and receiving. And these are perfect for long distance connection. So let's plug it into our SFP slot. And we're using this full string fiber optic cable. Now always use high quality ethernet cable or pre-made fiber optic cable to ensure a stable 10G speed. And this one here is, has four string and on each string it has label on them. And let's use string A. This is pre-made so we don't have to worry about the connector. 
is already plugged in. Coming over here, we have a 300 meters fiber optic cable. We are going to use it to connect to our 10G media converter here. So let's insert our SFP plus module. And remember we use string A. Let's mount it back on the DIN reel using this special bracket. String A So it's done. Let's power it up. We can see the indicated lights are on. I'm going to use another Ethernet cable to connect the Ethernet port to our Wi-Fi SS point. Now let's turn on the Wi-Fi. This one right here, it automatically connected to our wireless SS point. And let's go to our web page. And it's working perfectly fine. And once everything are connected, you can either configure the switch through the console port using the CLI commands or through a web interface, whichever you're more comfortable with. And I recommend setting up basic VLANs right off the bat to segment your network. For example, you can separate your server, IP cameras, and wireless access point into different VLAN for the better management and security. And next, I'm going to do a quick speed test. And here's what 2.5G look like in action. Now this switch handles both speed effortlessly, so you can rely on it whether you're expanding your network or planning for future upgrades. And speaking of future proving, always think ahead when configuring your switch. Leave room for additional VLANs, plan your IP allocation carefully, and ensure your uplinks can handle the bandwidth your network will need as it grows. And use a UPS, uninterruptible power supply, to protect your network equipment from power surges. And this will save your network from power outage and surges, preventing data loss or hardware damage. And one final tip, always label your network cables and ports Trust me, this will save you so much time during troubleshooting and future upgrades. Clear labeling can make all the difference when you're scaling your network. So there you have it. The 8-port 10G SFP Plus Layer 3 Managed Switch is an absolute must-have for upgrading your network to 10G speed with versatile port options, powerful management features, and future-proofing built right in. Now, thank you very much for watching us and don't forget to like, subscribe and leave a comment if you have any questions and I'll see you in our next video.